My name is Atif Hirji, and I am the Department Head of Student Leadership at W.P. Wagner High School here in Edmonton. We have a school Instagram page, um, and we've seen some inappropriate comments on, on some of our posts and things like that, hate-filled comments. And it's very unfortunate to see. It's, it's heartbreaking, it's, it's tough, it's, it's frustrating, it's angering. But I do think that we're not putting as much attention on it as we should be, um, which is why you know, this project is so important. Hate, right? That's a very, very strong term. And so what takes it from dislike to hate? I, I truly believe that no one is born racist. No one is born hateful. No one is born um, discriminatory. It, it has to be learned somewhere along the road. It, it stems from feelings of, of inadequacy, perhaps. Inexperience or imbalance of knowledge of others' shared experiences or others' lived experiences. Not understanding um, your own privilege um, or, or the power that you might hold. But what can we do maybe as a school to intervene, to step in, to mitigate some of that? And do we need to start doing that at an earlier age? Um, perhaps those are questions that we need to start considering. Calling it out when we see it. We talk about building safe spaces and creating safe spaces in our schools and our communities. Are we creating safe spaces in our online communities? It is going to be extremely uncomfortable, but we need to get comfortable with the uncomfortable because that's the only way that change can happen. The most important thing is ensuring that victims of online hate are supported. Creating safe spaces online for students, for adults, for community members to be able to engage in dialogue, discourse, conversation online. That's the most important thing.